Hey, welcome back to the channel. It's Chad here. It's been a little while since I've uploaded anything, but I kind of want to give you an update on where we're standing on the uh, entertainment system. Well, I'm still waiting on that Hisense TV, and now I'm hearing, um, I think July 14th um, is where it's available to ship. And that was from a company online called, I think it's called Smart Brand or Brand Smart. I've never heard of them, but uh, it is on there. I think one of my viewers are pointing that out to me. I um, appreciate that little heads up. Um, I'm still going to wait until it gets on Best Buy. The only thing about this company, I kind of want to go in and see it um, and get a hands-on buy it right then and there. Um, but it had it on sale for advertised or for pre-order. Like I said, it said it shipped on the 14th for $8.99. So that's even, that's good news. That's $100 cheaper than what it was scheduled to slate at. And I was happy for $9.99, but now it's $8.99. So that's even better. So um, I'm getting pretty excited about it. So I'm still waiting on that. So... While I'm waiting on that, I'm getting everything else in line, ready to go. Like I said, I did a video uh, just recently on my the sound system I'm going to use. It's the Avizio 5.1.2 surround sound system with Dolby Atmos. Um, I've got that ready to go. Um, still haven't obviously hooked it up in my TV. I'm not going to do that until I get my new one. There's really no sense of hooking all up and unhooking it. I really want to do all that. So, got that. Uh, I've got uh, also about 30 feet of coax cable so I can move the TV around a different location where I want it from. And I've got um, just recently picked up these uh, satellite speaker stands right here. Hope you can see that all right. Um, they are the, hope you can see that. They are the Atlantic. Um, speaker, uh, satellite speaker stands. Um, I kind of looked online a little bit, different places, and uh, these I think had the, as far as stands go, had the best features. Most stands are kind of comparable. Um, the problem with a lot of them, they just don't go too high, you know, like 38 inches, 36 inches. These go to 48 inches, which is four feet high. Um, I like to have some higher. They had some that were a little bit higher, I think they were like 57 inches, but you know, they were a little bit more money, plus they were really bulky, and um, I didn't like the uh, platform way it kind of took, it took up some, a lot of room, and the bass on was really big, and I just got these little bitty lights, you know, speakers to put on there, so I don't really need anything that uh, that heavy duty. So I got these, um, these, uh, like I said, these go up to 48 inches. Um, they, uh, there's two of them, obviously. They will be behind me setting up when I get my uh, speaker, my TV set up. Uh, they support up to five pounds um, of speakers and the video speakers only weigh like point, point eight something. I mean, they're really, really light. So they don't even, this is not even gonna be a question um, where are these gonna fit or not or hold them. Uh, I'm gonna open these up for the first time for you guys today. So I just ordered these on amazon.com. I believe they were like, um, I think $40, $44, that's free shipping. Uh, anything over 25 is free shipping, so that's kind of nice. Um, inside here, we've got our uh, the instruction book. Uh, well, actually, the instructional piece of paper, whatever they call the book. It just basically tells you what's included um, and if you need any kind of tools or not. Um, kind of do, do a little unboxing, I guess, here for you. Um, this is the stand base here. I'm going to show you here. Here's the stand base, what it looks like. A little triangular shaped base will sit on the ground and the, the stand will go in there. And uh, I'll probably post a video when everything's together when I have it, the speaker mounted up there. I'll post another speaker. I'll post a video of that showing you how I set it up. Um, it's supposed to be kind of a universal mount. And I was reading on some reviews and things about this, uh, this particular stand where it mounts. Here's the mounting piece that goes on the back, that goes on the top of the bar. Right here they are. Um, you see that? Basically, it's this, uh, open one up real quick. I want to kind of, it's kind of easier to show you than explain it. Um, hold on just one second. Pardon this interruption. We'll grab a speaker, make it even a little more easy. Okay, sorry about that. That's part of the problem with amateur videotaping. Um, basically, like I said, here's my speaker. It's really super light. Um, and these are 
um, it's got a little hole here, a little threaded hole here for the screws to go in and mount this. Basically, this thing will sit on this little base right here. I, I won't pull that out. It'll sit on that, and then that speaker, the screw will go, if you can see that. This will be what the back look like. Hope I'm not covering that. Hope I'm not covering that speaker hole, but you see that little hole there? The screw will go in there and that'll and it'll brace up against this bracket and it'll hold the speaker uh, to the uh, bracket. And that's how they that's how they that's how I'll hold them on. So um, heard some reviews about it that kinda had to uh, kind of bend these a little bit to get them to fit. So I might do some little minor modification, which shouldn't be bad. Um, so I don't think it's gonna be too bad of an installation. Like I said, when I get it up and running or get it put together, I'll I'll show you um, a stand together as well as a speaker mount onto it so you can kind of see how I did it and what I needed to do um, to get that done. Hi Molly, you want to get in here? Say hi to Molly. She's trying to sneak in here. She don't. She never leaves my side. She's kind of kind of a permanent fixture here, aren't you, girl? Yep. Be a standoff for her pillow so she can lay down. <laughs> uh, my little rescue dog. If you don't know, her name's Molly. I said she's a rescue poodle. I rescued her several years ago and. And uh, now I can't imagine her not being here. She's been a good girl. Um, so basically, like I said, in the box, you've got the uh, mounting hardware and the washers, um, some adhesive strip to mount to it. Um, and then, of course, the uh, the other bracket I just showed you. Um, there's two different sizes, actually. There's a larger one, and I guess there's a small one. I didn't realize that. I thought they, all, I thought they were the same size. But as you can see, One's quite a bit bigger than the other one. So if I could get by with it, I'll probably use a smaller one. So this thing ain't sticking up above my speaker and not, not looking good, not looking kind of bad. So good deal. So I didn't know that. So that's nice to know. Got a small one for a smaller speaker. Um, like I said, it's got the uh, the bars in here, the speaker bars that go into the, into the base. Um, there's another one. Here. At least telescope up and down, like I said, it goes down to like 20 some inches to 48 inches. They're saying that'll, that'll screw into your base. That end, if you can see that. There's threads on it. Pretty heavy duty. It's actually pretty heavy. I thought it kind of light, a light aluminum, but it's actually pretty heavy. It's actually pretty solid, actually. That's kind of nice. And these aren't no cheapy plastic thing. This is actually pretty metal. This actually seems pretty solid. Um, which I do like do like that. Like so it's got a threaded end on that. And here's the other end for that will telescope up and down however high you want it locks down. So that's how that works. Like so they just you can go up to however however high you want it. I'm gonna have max height obviously. Um there's that like I so said that back bottom will will uh, screw into this hole right here there's threads in there and it'll, it'll just go right in there and it'll be all ready to go so that's pretty much it in the box it's pretty straight and simple it's, it looks like it's gonna be pretty easy to put together but i'm going to put this together and i'm not going to do a video that because that'll take forever and then and uh i'll make it uh so i don't want to mess with that but when i do get it get it up and i'll show you um this how they look and i'll show you also mounted with one of my speakers on there so you kind of get an idea of what they look like and what i had to do maybe to modify it because i know the speakers that come with the sound system also have screws included um, to help mount these so i'm not sure if i'll have to use those or i'll have to use these i'm assuming i'll probably have to use theirs but uh we're going to find out here real soon i'll probably get this done and then have them kind of sitting off the side to Kind of have that one less thing to do when my TV gets here. I'll just be able to hook it up and boom and be good to go because I can set these out of the corners, corners out of the way. Um, so, um, you yeah, know, that, that's pretty much it for this video. Like I said, I'm getting pretty excited. Um, I just kind of wanted to show you what, kind of give you an update on what was going on. And I haven't posted a video in a little while. I want to kind of update you on where I was on the. Uh, my TV and my entertainment system. I'm just anxiously awaiting. You know, I remember back in. January, February, they were talking in the spring, so I was hoping by March or April, you know, all right, May for sure, then didn't come, and June's come and gone, and now I'm here on the 14th, so let's hope and pray that this is it, because I didn't expect to wait that long, but hey, 
it is what it is. Like I said, it's the TV I want. Um, I know there's TVs out that are out, but I just kind of got my mind set on this high sense because um, the lower end of high sense has gotten good reviews and it's not near the quality as the of the uh, 9A 9F is. So really looking forward to that 9F TV. I think that's going to be a, a very popular TV this year. I think it's going to be a good seller. So. If you got any questions or comments on this, like I said, you can post them down below. I'll be glad to uh, answer them best I can. Uh, when I post another video, I'll have it displayed, like I said, and I'll, be, and I'll be able to describe more how easy or how difficult it was to put together for you. So, hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Like I said, if you, if you do like my videos, please like and subscribe to it. Uh, you know what to do there. Um, and I'd like to keep uploading content. 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 Can't already talk today. And keep you notified, keep you up to date on where it's at. And I definitely can't wait for the uh, new TV videos. Those are going to be pretty exciting. So I'm going to be like a kid to candy store. Yeah, that's all I got for today. Thanks for uh, tuning in. I really appreciate all you guys that watch and, and appreciate all the comments. I love to hear the comments and see what you guys have to say um, because you know I learn off of you. Hopefully, you learn off of me, and we can you know just share ideas and, and uh, thoughts and uh, give our opinions on different products. That's what this is about. So thanks again to everybody for watching. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Thank you.